All right, so this is uh, going to be a video on getting the drivers for your wireless card to work on your Hackintosh. So as you can see, um, wireless isn't working. Um, first thing you want to do is get the text helper. I will have links for everything in the description below. And um, this is going to allow you to install the text or the drivers as what uh, Windows people call them uh, very easily. So you just want to put the IO8211 family text in there. And then there's also uh, together, it will also come with a, an injector. Now you see all the help online talks about manually injecting this with uh, like DSDT or whatever it's called. Um, I'm a pretty big noob when it comes to Macs. So I decided to, um, you know, uh, find a much easier way. And so this is this is going to do all of that manual stuff for you for this particular um, Athros wireless drive. So all you got to do is install the two kecks that it comes with in the package. The first one being the driver itself, and then the second one being the injector. So you're just going to put the PC, I mean, sorry, the Max um, password in, hit easy install, and um, it's very important that you use Kext Helper and not um, Kext Utility. Kext Utility did not work for me. Uh, Kext Helper did. And as you can see, I have all kinds of Kext files everywhere because I was messing around trying to get it to work. Now, the Kext Helper doesn't quit right for me. I always have to force quit it in order for it to work. Um, your mileage may vary. but uh, So once that's installed, all you got to do is... Um, reboot and then there's a little bit of work around that you got to do it might just pop up automatically for you but as you can see there's no wireless sign up at the top still you just got to go to system preferences network and you're going to add the little plus button you're going to add wi-fi and so all you got to do is click that little show wi-fi button you got wi-fi now at the top and turn wi-fi on All right, so it's connected to the Wi-Fi. The Wi-Fi symbol is a little funky right now. Yeah, it should be fixed um, once you restart. But just to show you that it did detect it now, this is kind of like the device viewer. Um, you can see the Atheros 9285, and this will work with a lot of the 928, you know, X numbers. Um, but you should be able to fix this by just turning it. I think it's because I turned the Wi-Fi on after I showed the icon. So let's let's uh, turn the icon off and then turn it back on. Yeah, so there you go. So everything's just fine. And I'll show you. I'll load up, uh, like, I don't know, Yahoo or something so that you guys can see that it actually now works on the Wi-Fi. And it's that simple. A lot easier than manually doing it.